Alrighty, so we have the world's most powerful crossbow right here. So this is called a reverse draw crossbow and this is a pulley system to make it easier to pull back because this is a ridiculous amount of weight to pull back. Once you have it latched in like that, you pull these up, up like this. And I'm having to pull really hard. I can't imagine doing it at full strength because that's like literally half the weight that is required to pull this thing back. All right, so once you have it cocked back, put the safety on, you can put the arrow in like that and it's locked in. All right, we are good to go. All right, so how many TVs do you think the world's most powerful crossbow will shoot through? Here we go, we're gonna do a first set with them lined up about a foot and a half apart and then we're gonna do a second set with them lined up back to back to back. So two poles, post your opinion, here we go. Here we go, you ready? Mm -hmm. Ready? Nope. Ready? Okay. In three, two, one. <laughs> oh, completely into the TV. I wonder. Oh my goodness. That's at least two. That's at least two. Two wrong TVs. Three. It went into the third TV. <laughs> we have a whole bunch of paint scratched off. And then right here we have like just the top part completely broken off. And that flew into the third TV here. Look at that. That's awesome. <laughs> here comes the arrow. Kadoosh. <laughs> that arrow just entered the matrix. Flies through the first two TVs easily, gets stopped, but the point still has enough energy, breaks off, and flies into that third TV. Freaking awesome. All right. Oh my goodness, this thing's... Ooh! <laughs> it's like a giant weight, dude. Like, oh my god. It's like a big dumbbell. It's, it's like in the movies, it probably got to just push it through. There you go. <sighs> You pull that sucker on through. All right. All right. You know what? Can we lay it down? I was thinking we could do this. Well, yeah, that'll work. Maybe. Broken. No, oh, man. That's fine. <laughs> That's fine. Just shoot a different spot, and it'll be still. Dude, my, my goal is going to be to break that other arrow. Just <laughs> <laughs> Robin Hood style. All right, but if this one survives, it goes to a kid in Africa or me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Shot number two. How many TVs is it going to go through? Let's find out in three, two, one. So it got through the first one, the second one, the third one, and into the fourth one, but did not get to the fifth one. The fifth one survives. Look at that. <laughs> Congratulations, you get a new TV. Here comes that arrow. Kaboom! The shockwave and the chunk. <laughs> In the second Phantom Clip, you can see when the arrow hits, the first four TV screens actually warp due to the force of the impact. Pretty awesome. So there you have it. The world's most powerful crossbow can shoot through four 4K TVs. Pretty freaking epic. What do you think of shooting this thing? It's pretty cool. It's, yeah. uh, like, like, it's a lot like a rifle. Yeah. I mean, you just squeeze <laughs> that trigger and off she goes, except no noise. <laughs> yeah, that thing's powerful. That's crazy. Yeah, so uh, Matt's gonna get the last TV here that survived. Congrats to Matt. <laughs> but this is a big thank you for him letting me and Darren come out and film this video. Uh, he has a company that he runs here, if you wanna tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, Benetti Explosives. We uh, cater to the UXO industry, so people that are out contracting to clean up ordinance, and we do a lot of corporate events. So if your company's looking for something fun to do, come on out. Cool. And Darren from Beyond Slow Motion also makes some cool videos. Yeah, I uh, run and operate a Phantom High Speed Camera. I do all kinds of cool videos with some of the most amazing talents in the world. Some really cool people. So if you want to check that out, links below, guys. Very cool. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Brandon Baldwin out.